When Dennis Elmer launched Priority Toyota in 1999, he made a commitment to not only serve the dealership's customers, but to also serve the community. And for 17 years, he has honored that commitment to customers with consistently high customer satisfaction and one of the highest customer retention rates in the nation. He also kept his commitment to serve the communities where his customers live, work, and raise their families. Through the years, Priority Toyota has supported many groups, the SPCA, the Chesapeake Wine Classics Educational Foundation, the March of Dimes, the Chesapeake Jubilee. But in the year 2013, the dealership was presented with its biggest challenge and its biggest opportunity to touch thousands of lives. The Charity Bowl, a 45-year-old institution dedicated to funding Christmas for needy children, was broke. Without help, it would cease to exist and hundreds of children would go without at Christmas. Priority Toyota accepted the challenge and set out to remake the Charity Bowl into the Priority Toyota Charity Bowl. And in the process, expand the event's mission to serve thousands more children throughout the region. During the Priority Charity Bowl's first year in 2014, the event broke all previous records, raising more than $100,000 and expanding to a dozen children's charities. The following year, the Priority Toyota Charity Bowl was reformatted to a co-ed flag football game played by elected officials, celebrities, and former college and NFL players. The crowds grew, and the event made another financial leap forward, raising more than $250,000 for children's charities. In May of 2016, the Priority Charity Bowl exceeded all expectations, becoming one of the region's most successful charities. More than 50 corporations, organizations, and individuals participated through sponsorships as volunteers and players. The Priority Charity Bowl became a part of Old Dominion University's Big Blue Day, with the game played in the university's 20,000-seat stadium. NFL sportscaster Tony Siragusa was on hand to deliver play-by-play -play commentary. Prizes, including a new Toyota, were awarded at halftime. Fans cheered the celebrity game and enjoyed a day of fun with their families. And the local CBS television affiliate broadcast live for two hours, covering a market of two million with Charity Bowl events and Priority Toyota's role in making it such a huge success. But here's the best part. Thanks in part to Priority Toyota dealer Dennis Elmer's commitment to match each donor dollar for dollar, this year's Priority Toyota Charity Bowl raised more than $400,000 for children's charities. Charities like the local children's hospital, Camp Grom, a massive 70-acre park and activity area for children with disabilities and wounded warriors. I Need a Lighthouse, a nonprofit devoted to prevention of teen suicides. Recovery for Kids, an organization that empowers kids to break free of addictions. CASA, court-appointed special advocates for children who are victims of abuse and neglect. The Joy Fund, the original beneficiary of the Charity Bowl that provides gifts for needy children at Christmas. In all, the Priority Charity Bowl made significant contributions to 20 charities, touching the lives of thousands of children and their families. I just feel like it's the right thing to do to give back to the community that you live in, that you grew up in. And there are many needs and we're never gonna fill them all. Some people call it quid pro quo. I, we don't see it that way. Um, we do it because we think it's the right thing to do. Dennis Elmer and the Priority Toyota team made the Priority Toyota Charity Bowl better and they made their hometown a better place. Priority Toyota, working every day to be best in town.